Hello lovelies, welcome back to my channel. My name is Amaka Doris and Amaka Doris. <laughs> Some people call me Amaka. <laughs> Amaka. Amaka. Yeah, Amaka Doris. Yeah, Amaka Doris. Whichever one you call me, no problem, I understand. <laughs> so, today's video, I'll be using this opportunity to thank everyone, each and every one of you lovelies. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you for the support. Thank you for everything you guys are doing for me. Really, really, I appreciate it. And may the Almighty God continue to bless all of you. You guys are so sweet. Awesome. Amazing. I have amazing people in my family. Oh, I'm so proud of you guys. I'm so, so blessed to have you guys. And if you are new to my channel, please... Uh, subscribe if today is the first day you are seeing this face please subscribe and give it a thumbs up if you like the video if you don't like the video no problem we are cool okay give it a thumbs down but don't do that so <laughs> thank you so much for everything thank you for every everything i'm going to still do a shorter video but today i'll be talking about my hair yes 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 my hair I know people have waited for this video for a long time. I've been wanting to do this video, but somehow, somehow, I've been, you know, you know, doing some stuff. So, uh, but first, before I tell you guys what I did to my hair, I have to tell you guys what actually happened to my hair. Yeah. That stuff happened to my hair as a result of the hair I made. I fixed the weave on on my hair and that was last uh, early this year towards around February yeah that was when I had that patches so I fixed my hair around February and from the starting of the hair to the finish was was painful as like very very painful like hell so I was bearing the pain and when I go home I was looking like a tortoise. I couldn't even turn my head like I couldn't turn my neck like this. I have to turn myself. So my Nigerian sisters who make hair and they know how it is when you make a painful hair. Hmm, you just you know turn yourself instead of turning your neck. That was what I was doing and it was not damn funny. Oh uh -huh. it wasn't funny at all. So I had this hair on and my mom on the day I returned she gave me panadol. Mm. I had I took the panadol and I had that panadol for days, like days. Till the day I loosened this hair, it was still painful. It never stopped cutting. Honestly. So that particular place I had that patches will always itch me, like itching, 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 and I will always itch it. It will <gasps> sweet and at the same time painful so i had the hair on when i couldn't bear the pain anymore two weeks three weeks i had it on for like two three weeks and i losing the hair when i losing the hair i realized that all the hair there has gone it has gone and when i noticed they've gone all the hair there has disappeared and i have the a map of the world on my head and now have bar head on a particular place so my mom saw it and she was like okay don't worry I'll do something to it but you have to be covering it with your other hair like you have to be making your hair like ponytail and I wasn't comfortable yeah I wasn't comfortable with it at all so I couldn't I couldn't do the ponytail anything so I had to shave it she wasn't in support of me shaving my hair but hey that's what I wanted to do so I knew she wouldn't let me so I had the hair for like some days and I went out when I went out I went to a salon and I got a shave I shaved it and I had my piece but the problem was that the patches was there and it was not damn obvious Anybody can see it. I am not short. Don't call me short. Call me portable, okay? I am not short, but anybody that comes close to me will notice that. 
Oh yeah. The person will notice that I have a bad head and the bump of the word on my head. So people will go on and ask me, oh, what happened to your head? And I have to explain how I got a nice looking head that people were complimenting. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, it's beautiful. And when I losing it, I became, my hair became, oh, it's patches. Oh, it's <laughs> My hair became bad. So I, I, it was really, it was not really funny, but hmm, what to do? This is life, huh? I had it on and the day I noticed that thing, my mom, the day I shaved it, okay, before I shaved it, the day I washed it and noticed that I had no hair there, my mom went to the kitchen, she got ginger, she got garlic, she got uh, onion, these three things. That was what she mixed together. She grated them together and she used it to massage that particular spot. She massaged every. She massaged it so hard, like it's still God's grace. I still have my head on my neck. Sorry, Mama. I know you see this, but that's true. She massaged it. African sisters, you guys know how our mothers handle things like that. It must go by fire by force. That place is not the house, have you? So she massaged my hair like she oh God. and after which I the next day, after a few days, she was still doing it, but after a few days I went to shave it off. Like anytime you know you guys know that feeling, right? Anytime I raise my hand on my head, I just go to that particular place. <laughs> So I could not bear it. I just shaved it up. And when I did, I she said, Okay, since you decide to shave it up, it's okay. It's even perfect. It will be enough, it will be okay for me now to do exactly what to scrub it very well. <laughs> so she started the scrubbing the scrubbing thing. She scrubbed it every evening before I go to sleep. Every evening before I go to sleep, she will grate it. Do yeah she was doing it for me oh my sweet mama yeah i'm a mommy's girl i love my mom sorry no thanks yeah i love my mom so much so she was scrubbing my hair for me i was on holiday then so i spent my holiday with them and after my vacation was over i was about going i left them i left them on the seventh of March, so throughout the ending of um, uh, February, that I had that thing on, she scrubbed my head to that seventh of March when I left, and I left them, and you know I go back to where I reside, and every time she will always come in to ask me, oh how is the hair, oh how is the hair, the pictures you guys saw on the, on the on the previous video, on the other video, I didn't take it for YouTube. I didn't take it to post it on YouTube or what. I took that picture because I was taking those pictures to show her updates on my head. How the scrubbing is going, you know. So, just like my mother's daughter that I am, I got back to my base. I started scrubbing my hair also. This time I, I added more things to the scrubbing. Just one thing anyways. I started scrubbing this the, that particular place with my body scrub because the hair was ba bad hair. <laughs> it was bad. <laughs> it was bad. Like the more I do things, it was like it's not going to. Though my brother will always tell me that I can see hair there is going, but when I touch it, it feels like nothing is coming out. It feels like it's not growing at all. So. I couldn't have that patient to wait for the ginger and onion and the garlic to be doing their work, you know. Though they were working, but I was not having that patient enough. So, oh God, if you know me, you know. I don't have patience for all those things. I just started having patience for pimples and all these things just now. I had to take a scrub, body scrub. I always scrub them when I, whenever I'm scrubbing my body. I will take some more, go there and scrub. I showed you guys the scrub I used, so 
and that's the scrub i would always take it and go there and give it small you know in case if something is covering my scalp and you know it can't excuse me let that thing go off so i had i scrubbed and scrubbed and scrubbed and i was applying the ginger onion and oh my hair started going out when i noticed when i now finally noticed that my hair has started growing out like you know from the pictures i'm taking touching it there i know that so that wasn't the only thing i did after i noticed that i was happy so i started also using hair cream because my hair is 4c hair when i say 4c hair if there is anything more kinky than 4c hair you know nigerian hair is very kinky no not nigerian hair sorry some african hair some people some people not all our hair is just kinky 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 so my hair is among those people who have the kinky 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 hair <laughs> so that's the hair i have my hair is so kinky like it's so kinky it's tough and strong like the owner sorry but that's true it's very strong it's very kinky very so that particular place was so soft and my other other hair every other place is so strong like so kinky so i was happy that that place was soft because and I, I don't have soft hair and i want to have a soft hair. so now that place is soft and this side is is strong i don't know what to do i you know i started applying this some hair cream when i noticed that that place has grown out i got the hair cream so i started applying hair cream on my hair so i'm going to show you guys the hair cream that i'll be applying and but before then you guys should look you will see this is the place i don't know if you can see i don't know if you guys can see this all this place i had that that uh, map of the world the drawing all this place you guys can see how the hair has grown back i even had it here it was wide open at this place i don't know if you guys can see it very well but those are the place i i think you guys can skip see my scalp is my hair i didn't put anything there to show you guys so it's my hair it's my hair so that was it i said when that place is green and it's soft and this side is kinky so it, it's still kinky that's my hair anyways that's how my hair is so i decided to get a a hair cream to help it so i got this hair cream i got this this is a shampoo i have the leave-in conditioner so i i i got this canto i don't know if you guys can see it i got this canto natural hair cream the hair shampoo it has shea butter in it i i got it i was using it and i have the the leave-in conditioner it's not closed that's why i didn't bring it out i have the use leave-in conditioner i don't wash my hair every day because people who are here you guys know where i am Abby. people who live here also they said they said not me they said that what the water here is not good for the hair so i don't wash my hair every day <clears throat> I don't, they said though not me that said they said I don't <laughs> I don't wash my hair every day so the I have this one and I have the living condition then when I was using this one it was okay it was good and somebody told me a friend of mine uh, introduced me to this particular hair cream Dr. Skin uh, Argin Oil is hair is hair cream it's hair conditioner and at the same time hair cream I don't know if you guys can see it properly I don't know if you guys can see it properly. A friend of mine introduced me to this hair cream, and this hair cream is so good, it's so awesome, it's so sweet, amazing, it does an amazing job. So you should get this if you if you are having hair loss like me. It also helps your hair to get soft if you have kinky hair like me. Me also. I add I use this one to wash. I use the living living conditioner. I apply it, then I apply this one also. So to show you guys, this one is almost finished. You see, it's empty. You see, it's just I have little. 
down there. I have little here. But I also have this one, you see. As you can see. It's, it's almost empty. It's somewhere here. Sometimes I take from here and I, I put on this one. Because it's same, the it's same, uh, it's same thing. But this one is bigger than this one. This one is a small one. And this is the big one. So I use this on my head. This is what I use. And it's working so well. Perfectly well. Yeah. So it's cool. Really. It's very, very nice. These two hair creams are so nice. That's what I use. And I also use hair... Uh, virgin hair cream i also use that one i got it new but back in my country i've been using that one that one is also good so if you can see it anywhere you are you can get it also if you have this kind of my hair loss because then you know sometimes when you have problem you don't think of the things you know i know that if i had if i had been uh, if i had bought that uh, virgin uh, hair cream and i'm i'm and I apply it on that particular spot. It will help my hair to grow fast. <clears throat> I know it, it helps. I know. I know it grows hair. That one is for sure. But I could not think of it. And I couldn't get it. But luckily, some one day I went to the shop here. And I saw it and I got it. So if you, you can also buy that one and use it. If you have a hair loss. If you are not... Uh, hair is Africans, they know it. So if you are not from... If you're not no you guys shouldn't feel bad okay when i say africans non-africans you guys shouldn't feel bad because why i say that is because um i'm an african and most things we know we know some things you guys use who those who are not africans i might not know them so that's why i always use that and i say that so that you know that when you if you really want to use it and you're not from Africa, you, sh you should look out for it in African shop. So you guys don't feel bad. We are all one, okay? I love you guys, regardless. I love you guys. We are all one. We are all human beings. So I love you guys. But the thing is that the almighty creator, he has made it to be so obvious by giving us this kinky hair and giving you guys this soft and nice hair. Very long, you know. <laughs> Our hair is also nice. I love my hair. I love this my kinky stubborn hair like the one now I love it yeah but that's the difference I just made it to be very obvious so that's why I always refer African hair African hair African hair got it so that is it thank you so much for stopping by if you stay till this moment and you've not given me a thumbs up what are you waiting for what are you waiting for please give it a thumbs up and share 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 it to your friends those who need to grow their hair and subscribe please until i come your way next time my name is amaka doris and i love you guys so much let's keep growing thank you and bye bye i want to use this little opportunity though i'm still going to do my shout out but i just want to use this little opportunity to say thank you to you guys you guys are so awesome Ooh, you guys are so wonderful who cares about haters when i have you guys Ooh, i don't care i don't care about any other person that wants to hate since you guys are in my life i'm so blessed i don't need any other thing hmm. i'm okay with you guys really with the love in whitey, I feel like I have new family. Not that I feel like now I have new family. I know that you guys got my back. Just like I got your back, you know. So, thank you so much for stopping by. Yeah. Remember, don't give up. Keep going. Keep pushing. No matter what, we will get there. So, I want to thank you guys for everything. For everything. If you guys notice my black spots is going little little yeah it's not magic it's step by step i don't know i had this kind of spirit today i don't know i'm behaving somehow i've made this video a hundred times and it's coming out like this i keep saying something else while making the video so i'm tired of editing people have it like this i like being me okay so just take me the way i am thank you so much i love you guys so today i'm going to be talking about my hair mm -hmm, mm -hmm. i got the message i got the mm.